What's going on guys? This is Goofy Goop the Balls, bringing you guys an Infinite Warfare kind of public service announcement video about the FTL combat rig, the phase shift payload, and the perception trait. I've been using these a lot lately and I've kind of realized that they're pretty overpowered and especially when combined, they might be borderline broken. So if you don't know what the phase shift payload is, it basically transports you into another dimension for a few seconds, and when you're in this other dimension, no players can see you, nobody can do damage to you, and you can just freely roam around the map and do whatever you want, completely unseen, and after those few seconds, you drop back out, and you're back in the map. And the perception trait makes your screen flash yellow whenever there's an enemy looking at you who you can't see on your screen. So it's basically kind of like Sixth Sense from Black Ops 3, but a little bit stronger than that. So I mean, just the idea of the phase shift itself already sounds pretty overpowered. For a few seconds, you get pure invisibility and pure immunity from anything, and you can pretty much run behind anybody who shoots you. And an example of how you could use it is, if you see someone and you know you're going to lose a gunfight, you just pop the phase shift, just run straight behind them and get an easy kill. And there's tons of other ways you can use it too. And just to show you guys how ridiculous this is, I'm going to show you guys a few clips from one game, actually. Just all these clips are from one game when I was using this. So take a look at the first one here. So I ran into that hallway, well aware that there were enemies and that there was gunfire going on, and that I would probably die. And just as a panic reflex, I just used the phase shift and went prone and laid there for a few seconds. Nobody saw me, nobody could do anything. And when I came back into the regular dimension, that enemy you could see was just running straight past me. He didn't see me because he couldn't see me, and I was able to get a really easy kill and survive when I really shouldn't have. So now take a look at the second clip. So now this one's even more ridiculous. I'm shooting at this first guy, and then I know I'm damaged, I know I'm at a disadvantage when I see the second guy, so I immediately just pop the phase shift and run into that corner. But I can actually hear his footsteps, so I know exactly where he is, so right when I pop out of the phase shift, I can just aim right at him and get an easy kill. That's a little bit overpowered too. I think you shouldn't be able to hear enemy footsteps when you're in the phase shift, because, I mean, technically you're in another dimension, that doesn't make sense. But that kind of just adds to the unfairness and sort of unbalancedness of this payload. And now for the final clip, take a look here. So because I was using the perception trait, my screen lit up yellow when that enemy was looking at me because he wasn't on my screen. And clearly I had no idea where he was at all, that's why I was like jumping up in the air and just panicking completely. But right then I got my phase shift and used it. And as you can see that clearly saved me from that death because it just put me in that other dimension, the enemy couldn't do anything about it, and he started to run away. And right as I came back into the dimension, I saw him, ran over to him, and was able to get an easy kill on him. So those are just a few examples, and again, I got those all in one game. And I got it actually fully charged in that game about five times, and it was about a nine minute game. So the fact that this can happen up to five, maybe even six times a game, is pretty unfair if you ask me. Almost broken, like I said. I mean, maybe if it happened once a game, it would be okay. It would still kind of be unfair, but once a game is, you know, something you can live with. But five to six times a game is a little bit ridiculous, especially when there's no counter to this at all. I mean, phase shift itself, when you use it, and you're in that other dimension, there's absolutely nothing to counter it at all. You are completely unseen, there's not even like a silhouette outline of you, and nobody can do damage to you. So I mean, in itself, that's pretty unfair. So maybe they should add some sort of counter to this, like maybe add it to cold-blooded, where you'd be able to see the outline of the person, so that you have kind of a general idea of where they are. So I think using this combination on the FTL combat rig could get out of hand pretty fast, and if I'm able to do this after just a few games of using it, imagine what people could do with it after using it for days, weeks, months even. That's what I want to share with you guys, just a public service announcement about what this is and how it might get abused. So leave a comment down below with what you think about this. Do you think it's overpowered? Do you think it's fine? Have you been killed by this in any ridiculous way? Do you think that there should be a counter to this and what should it be? Answer any of those questions in a comment or any other thoughts you have on this. I'm very interested to hear what you guys have to think. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button, help support my channel, and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.